Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how I glaze and seal my terracotta saucers. Terracotta is very porous and I've had these before sitting on like a wood table. I've got my plant on here, watered it, a little bit of water comes in there and I kind of forget about it and the water kind of soaks up into the plant and no big deal. But then when I go to move it, I notice that there's a watermark or some water damage on the wood. That's because I didn't have my plant sitting in a glazed uh, terracotta saucer. Terracotta is porous. Any moisture that you leave in here will leach out onto the bottom and if you have it on wood that moisture is going to collect and that's where the water damage is going to appear. So today I'm going to show you how I do it with just a few simple things. I'm going to be using Rust-Oleum's premium latex paint in clear gloss. I have used this in the past before. It works great. Typically I use about four to five coats per saucer and I found that that does a great job and any moisture doesn't seep through to the bottom. I'm also going to be using a couple of disposable foam uh, paint brushes and some gloves. So let's get to it. And there it is. So I'm just gonna go ahead and do all the rest of them. All right, guys, I'm going to let these dry for about 30 minutes to an hour, and then I'm going to come back and do this all over again four more times. <laughs> That was the fifth coat. I'm gonna give them a few hours to dry and then I'll come back and show you the final product. Here's our finished product. The saucers are all glazed, sealed, and waterproofed. Uh, just to recap, I used the Rust-Oleum Premium Latex Paint in clear gloss. I applied it with a disposable foam brush and I used five coats. I let them dry about an hour between each coat and then get, let them dry fully for a few hours. But on the back of the label, it does say, give them 24 to 48 hours to fully cure. So I'm gonna give them the full 48 hours before I put these to use. Anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I can't wait to see you in the next one. Leave me a comment in the comment section below and let me know what you think. And I'm gonna put a link in the description box for the paint that I used. Thanks guys again. Have a great day. Bye.